Hello everyone and welcome to another game trailer react. This is a particular game that I'm super excited for. I totally miss that Xbox did a game showcase this week um, just because of all of the hype with Dragon Age and I have done a reaction to the actual gameplay trailer that dropped yesterday. So have a look at that if you are wanting to see what my general thoughts of the game is. Please note that I am not not an OG Dragon Age play game player. I have played Inquisition, which I absolutely loved, and um, I've just gone into it with an open mind. I did enjoy the game trailer, but this one, this is what I'm talking about, Fable. Fable 4, I absolutely loved the Fable series. Two and three were some of my most favorite all-time games that I played. I love the fantasy style, I love the storylines, the humor, just all the characters, the way it looks, Looks. So I'm super excited. I know that it's not probably had as much hype as some of the other game trailers that have been coming out because it is ha having to be the most biggest time of the year I think when it comes to game releases and things that are upcoming especially with the Elden Ring DLC but I am so excited for this this is something that I would definitely do a game series on so let's talk more react let's have a look see what it has to offer fingers crossed it is falling in line with all of the rest of the fable uh, games in the series but I'm so so happy that this is coming Oh, right, Jew. Music. So, you want to know all about heroes, do you? Well, mm -hmm. you have come to the right place. Because, uh, in game you footage, tell you all about them, then it looks perhaps the greatest. It looks very, hero very of them good. All. Yeah. There he is. He seems you know, quite binary. familiar. She is. Maybe I know a few people that talk like that. I don't know. <coughs> Humphrey, Albion's greatest hero. So Albion is obviously falling in line with the series then. King Albion. I'm sure you get your mega fans. You are like literally my favourite person. You <laughs> haters. It's like a fan club, but we hate you. Your uh, chances <laughs> and uh, the occasional giant toad. Keeping up with the fantasy then, love that. But it's more than that. It's about the choices you make. I'm a hero. I should do what I want. You thought you could save her. You know, it's your life and death Something stuff. Something deeper That's than what defines you. the storyline. Really uh, stays with you. I knew this one here. Wow. I took her in. It definitely has the same sort of aesthetic as the last Fables, which is fantastic. Club in all of Albion. Obviously, it looks a lot better than the older get games. Out there. That's Make what the you most expect. But you know what it's like when you're young and you have a point to prove. <laughs> I tell you. Wow. Kid, she had it all: the skill, the talent, the power. Oh. She was something else, all right. She was. Terrifying. Huh. So, yeah, I knew this girl once who made all the wrong choices. Humphrey, she's back. Wow. I'm definitely get the fable, get getting the fable feels. This Ooh. place, and no one is going to stand in my way. Wow, 2025. Xbox Series and Steam. Excellent news. Play um, one. I definitely get the Fable series feel. It's definitely, definitely in line with that. The humor is there. That character was specifically quite funny to me. Um, it obviously, set in Albion again. So, from what I remember from the previous games, uh, you have King Albion and the last Fable 3. I think we were the daughter of the king that had died. So, it definitely looks like it's carrying on, or maybe. Maybe it's far, far further in the future. Um, you have these two 
uh, specific characters that I mentioned, the guy that's telling the story and the girl. So I'm really, really intrigued. It's quite a short trailer, look, just like a little bit of a teaser. So I'm hoping that we get something a little bit more maybe towards the end of the year. Um, it just says 2025 as well. So it may be another year before we actually get to play it. But yeah, it looked amazing. I love that they kept the same sort of style and aesthetics as the last Fables from what I remember and what I'd expect. Um, I'm super excited. I don't envision it being maybe a very long game, but that's fine. And I think that is good for a little series. So if you're interested, please give this video a like. Give me a comment down below. What do you think? Are you into the Fables? Is it something that you would definitely pick up next year and want to play? I'm super excited. I cannot wait. I'm really, really stoked that all of these games are coming out, these trailers of gameplay and just the stories. Next year is going to be huge. We have GTA next year and now for me, Fable, which is a big one for me, possibly a new Skyrim. Who knows when it comes to Bethesda, but I am all in. I am all for it. Super, super excited. It's a great time for gamers. I will tell you that. It is, I've come from uh, playing games from when I was as a kid up to now and the amount it has progressed and developed is unreal super excited puppy's excited you're excited thank you so much take care and until next time ta-ta